Okay, now I'm going to show you a pretty high level uh, gift making technique with uh, smart objects. Suppose we want to change out Buff's head from that gift we just made. We want to change it to whatever. So let's open a, a file. File, open. And I know I have a Frank Mirror in here that will work. So I'll open this one. And the reason I'm selecting him is because the angle of his, uh, his what's this called, jawline is very similar to Buff's. Whereas something like this is, is similar, but it's different because of the hat. So I'm just picking this one. We could pick Gegard also, but this is the one I'm picking. We open up Frank Mir and we go edit, select, oops, sorry, sorry, select all, edit, copy. Now we have Mir copied into memory. We go back here and I'm just going to rename the buff layer. I'm going I'm to rename it buff. And it's a smart object. So you double click on this part of the layer. Clicking on this part of the layer will, do, will be different than clicking on this part. If I click here, I can rename it. If I click here, layer styles will come up. Uh, so don't worry about what layer styles are. We can go through all, through all this later. So we click on the smart object icon, which will bring up the buff smart object. So as you can see, we have layer 22 PSB. That's the actual smart object. Don't worry about what all this means. Just follow these directions. Now remember we have Frank Mir copied into memory. So we're going to edit, paste him into here. Now he's facing the wrong way. So we go edit, free transform, edit, transform, flip horizontal, and we're going to resize him to approximately approximately the size of Buff. But as you remember, Buff was a little small, so we're going to make him a little bit larger. We want to make sure the jaws line up and it lines up as, as good as possible. So now we have Frank Mir on top. We can get rid of Buff. We're just going to click the eyeball to get rid of him. But as you can see, we now have a bad cropping. That's not an issue. What you do on the Frank Mir, on, on this part of the layer, you control click and watch. It will put the marching ants all the way around Frank Mir. I don't know if you can see them, but they're there. So now we have Frank Mir selected and we hit the crop tool and that will recrop it to the size of Frank Mir. So at this point you can double click or double enter to commit the changes. So I'm going to press enter, enter. Now we have Frank Mir replacing buff inside of the smart object. So what we have to do now is save this smart object. File, save, and now the magic will come. We go back to the MP4 file. Remember it had buff as a head. Now it has Frank Mir. Magic. Okay, let's do that one more time, but we'll change it with, uh, what's his name? Johnny Walker. So I know I have a walker in here somewhere. There he is. And this one is different shape. So let's just see how it looks. That's, that's why I picked this one, because it has a different shape. So I go select all, edit, copy. Now I have him copied into memory. We can close this file out. And um, I'm not sure if we can still work on this one that's open, this smart object. So we're going to close it, go back to the uh, original MP4 GIF, and double click on Buff again to reopen it. And I'm pressing Control V, or I can go Edit Paste. And that puts Walker on top. And we'll resize Walker, Edit, Free Transform, and we'll kind of eyeball him and you see his head is really thin so we might have to make him just a little bigger than Mir I, I'm not really sure you have to mess with that and we'll get rid of Mir and we'll do the same trick 
control click crop and we'll go file save and let's see how this looks there now we have it with Walker um, as you can see Walker is he's maybe a little small so what we can do is go here and we can um, let's see we're gonna crop it a little wider and a little taller and we'll resize Walker edit free transform we'll make him just a little bigger and maybe a little wider I don't think anybody anybody will notice file save and we go back to buff and now we have Johnny Walker what this is good for is since you're making your ISL GIF ahead of time suppose later on you want to swap heads well you can with this method method and that's it